As a Pomeranian, I was really excited to watch Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, once and always. But boy, was I disappointed. Where were the dogs in the cast? And why were there no squirrels for me to chase? The movie was supposed to be about superheroes, but all I saw was a bunch of humans running around in weird costumes. And don't even get me started on Billy. That guy hasn't aged well at all. Seeing him in that Power Ranger costume again was just plain awkward. And what was with the new additions to the team? Cat and Rocky just showed up out of nowhere. It was like sitting by the door and barking to go outside, only to realize you just went out ten minutes ago. You showed up, but you didn't really need to be there. It was cool, but the whole robust thing reminded me of diet water my human got me yesterday. Pointless. And Buck and Skull only had a billboard. What a letdown. Trini's daughter was a great fighter but an okay actress. She was like a squirrel who's good at climbing trees but can't quite get the hang of digging holes. So, unless you want to sit through another movie that doesn't have a single dog in it, I suggest you steer clear of Mighty Morph and Power Rangers. Once and always. But hey, don't let my opinion stop you from watching it. Maybe you enjoy it more than I did. If you want to keep up with my movie reviews from a dog's perspective, be sure to like, comment, and follow. Who knows, maybe one day we'll find a movie that has more dog representation and squirrels to chase. Woof woof.